So I had a lady ask me how um, she could make a one layer um, design into multiple layers. And what it was was just text. Um, so I just went ahead and typed this out. It's all um, one object. It's all on one layer and it's all one color. If I change the color, it changes all of it, okay? But what she wanted to do was just change one word. She wanted to um, use a different font and she wanted um, it to be a different color from the rest of it. And normally the comment is slice it, but that's a little misleading because if I, um, hit the right button and I um, insert a square and if I unlock the square and I place that over top and I slice it um what's going to happen is nothing it's still going to be one layer it's still going to be one color this is one layer one color you cannot change it individually okay so take a square and we'll place it over the word Mary and only the word Mary and then we'll slice it and what that's going to do is it's going to separate the word Mary from the rest of the image here see this is still one but this is now um, on its own and the color can be changed to whatever color you wish all right, so then if you want to go ahead and separate these, you would take a square and place it over only one of the words and then select it and slice it. And then that will separate this one from this one and you can have them all whichever colors you want okay so that's how you do that now a lot of times people will say contour okay so let me go ahead and delete this and I'll upload it again and we'll take a look at contour now you can do it contour but the thing is if you have um you know multiple words um, every little um, inside of the letters is going to be something you're going to have to contour out and let alone the letter itself so you could end up with a ton of stuff to contour okay uh, you know for something like this I I wouldn't use contour um, it's our time waster number one if I just want this word Mary I have to go through and I have to click on every letter and every um, cutout within those letters okay and let's take a look so everything is highlighted except for the E, the R, R, M, I, and we need that to be contoured. And I believe that's it. So if I close that out, now I'm left with just the Mary. So I can go ahead and make that, cut it, and then I can go back and I can select it and go back to contour and then I can go down to the bottom where it says hide all contours and then show all contours and then um, I can click on the Mary and hide the Mary but as you can see that's a lot more time consuming than and then this is still on one layer so if you wanted to separate it like I did earlier you would have to um, you know contour out this line or you know the word Christmas again um, and then you could cut this it's just more time-consuming 
for me, I think, um, doing the contour than it is to just take a square and, you know, chop it up that way. So um, I hope this helps you um, get your words isolated the way that you want them. Thanks for watching.